This is for all the gooners out there, you know? And I know there's a lot of gooners in the anime community. This one, this, 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 this one is for you. And with that, I have a beautiful audience who happens to also be 99.9% .9 women who all look like this. Factual. But also in the booth community, I also get family friend anime request. So let's talk about it. Number one, we got Boko No Stop. Number one, we got Goblin Slayer. Goblin Slayer. Goblin Slayer. Okay. Let's let let's let him let's let's okay. Which had one of the most insane anime opening episodes of all time in a cave. What is this Minecraft? Hey, MC YouTubers, watch out for the miners. Wait, weren't you a Minecraft streamer? What oh, are they looking that for? Was crazy. Diamonds? Quick reminder: ninety-nine percent of gamblers give up before their big win. <laughs> Come on, we gotta keep going. Oh uh, yes. What the fuck, yeah. Bro, these the way these goblins pulled up in this first episode. And what they were doing was pure insanity. We'll, we'll, we'll lead with that. It was pure, 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 pure insanity. Like actual. Yeah, but like it was pure insanity, dude. Like it was actually crazy. Like I'm just being, I'm being like completely honest. The shit was crazy. It was like the craziest shit I had seen in the first episode before I seen Redo Healer. You know, before I seen Redo Healer. And I was like, damn, Redo Healer is crazy. Redo Healer is macro. Are those goblins? It's in the name, bitch. Bro, and these goblins were hunting them. Like actual, bro, like actually hunting them. It wasn't like just like some like oh they just ate them and what they were hunting them, bro. It was fucking crazy, dude. Like actually. I got this. Hey brother, you might be wondering, how did I get in this position here? Well, this is the story on how Yeah, I'm B Rod did not make it out of this. I actually died. Um like there's there's no there's no happy ending. It was that crazy, bro. That crazy. Oh my gosh, they're eating him up like a ten piece McNugget! Yeah, with my friends in the back. It's my turn to be a hero. I died. They do her something dirty. They do her something dirty, dude. Do her something dirty, dude. Alert. We do a healer alert. We do a healer alert. Yeah, 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 yeah. They was doing them like that. Like that's the type of um timing that that first episode was and i was like bro what the fuck hear ye hear ye so yeah the goblin slayer writers were definitely off the park easy i mean to construct a story that starts off like that and never peak again you gotta be an interesting individual but speaking of interesting individuals shout out to the ones who introduced me to gushing over magical girl i've never heard of this i've never heard of this gushing over anime girls how do we feel about this chat how do we feel about this gushing over magical girls? How do we feel about this? This already looks very insane. Like nothing about this looks good. It looks really bad actually, but we are here, right? So let's continue. Girls. This is a beautiful family friendly show that is Hanukkah, a Powerpuff Girl knockoff. What in the Clyde month is going on up there? Over noisy. Remember, never back down, never what? Yeah. But unfortunately, all that Mickey Mouse Cinderella story propaganda BS got ended. What's when this thing straight out of Pokemon showed up? Hold on, let me try and throw my balls at it. Nah, that's actually crazy, bro. That was funny as shit. Ah, I turned into a villain. Oh, and I forgot to mention this show got a Twitter aspect. And I mean, I'm not trying to make a correlation or anything, but I'm just saying. Oh, and look, the ops done pulled up. I, 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 I don't want no smoke. Damn. Not gonna lie, that was kind of OP. She just got her powers and made a flower that looks that strong. Hold on. Lock in. Gushing over magical girls. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, by the way. Man, what this big girly flower gonna do though? Of course, never mind. Never mind. Nah, bro. Did he really put that LeBron? Bro. 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 Why did he put this LeBron, this gif of LeBron in the middle, bro? Why did he put this gif of LeBron in there, dude? I need y'all to answer that question for me. Like, I I'm actually yelling right now. I need you guys to answer that question for me. Like, I need y'all to answer that for me. Someone. Someone, please. Help me, please. That shit's crazy. Yeah, this biscuit doodle done turned this flower into a why do I need to look at your thing while I'm screaming, bro? 
in the middle of making and a YouTube video. I wish I had video. words to explain the animation in this. Oh, but hell hold no. Doodle, you better get off whatever. You better this get off that so website. We not, we not watching that. And then it got worse. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold for loading. This bit don't lost her free. So for research purposes, review this for YouTube. Mickey mind. Spun me next. What the fuck, Doodle? Stop at this instant. Yo, I know. And she just kept smacking the Skaluka Dukes off their cheeks. I mean, they legitimately crazy, had long-term damage on their bunions. And even when they tried to spin back on the ops, it was put back in a blender. Okay, where's she at? Wait, I said something. Mannequin noises. Yeah, okay. Here I come. I'm coming. I'm coming. Well then. Well then. Well then. So, that is, that is something. That is something. Like, actually, ridiculous. Was not expecting that. <laughs> Was not expecting that. This is, um, turning into more of a journey than expected. But since we're already here, we might as well see it through to the end. Yup, they done lured them into tickle torture. And Shotty said, no, little baby, it's my turn. Do you, you like that? <laughs> now this next one's for the fan service. And to think there are 12 more episodes of this. But you know what only had two episodes, but still left a scar in my brainington? Now this show right here is perfect. What was the show? My brainington. Aiken? I've never even heard of this. But this looks like it would be terrible to watch. For real, my nest show so wild i didn't even say the name <gasps> also because i didn't really want to butcher the uh the uh, pronunciation innocence uh yeah yeah uh, i'm gonna be real that was the, that is honestly the reason why i didn't say it with the auto but this show's genres consist of comedies from edgy nah well, I'll tell you, no this thanks was the ultimate no thanks boing boing anime i have never seen it really. listen we've seen jiggle faces before hold your breath you gotta hold your breath bro first scene we see a boy and they're already wilding with the anime and not to mention, this was made in 2003, the year after I was born. Show so I would have got them black board. And approximately at 40 seconds, the whole show begins. Banana pill. Slow motion. Booty. Motion. Wait, that's the dude who scored the highest score on the entrance exams. Of course he is. Bump that. Did you see how he landed? Great Google, it feels like I'm back at Skies on the way I just landed softly. Uh, excuse me, sir? What the fudge? But instead of getting detention what or something, we're actually please? using the very expensive knowledge that he has to continue his educational prowess. A random lady from the sky. <laughs> 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 I'll to scoop him up. My name is Miss Yeeks Woman. Hey, Miss Yeeks Woman. Congratulations, Bro, you've been so what? <laughs> now go ahead and sign this 360 damage. Shut up, you submissive boy. Let's sign the paper. Oh, I welcome you to the Icon Club. Was that necessary? Indubitably it was, because now Bro went from being a regular average student who also used to sneak a look into the girls' locker room. I love relatable shows. To the equivalent of the game best friend with all the shotties at a sleepover. Here's the headquarters. I've definitely seen this somewhere before. Welcome to the main lobby. Is that, is that Freddy Fazbear? Sailor Moon? Bro, please. Holy crap, this is an awkward angle, huh? I love this angle. So what you doing over here? I'm just trying to get Pack-A-Punch. Hey, bit, what you got going on over here? Oh, hello. Yeah, I think I'm about to combust. Hey, can, can you help me reach this thing real quick for the fan service? Oh, oh yeah, for sure. Uh, uh, now pan over to the other girl eating a banana. Uh, Oh, yeah, hold on. Is this working? Oh, yeah, is this working? Whoever made this show was definitely on some different type of timing, bro. Uh, yeah. They might be wondering, these are a lot of clips without context. Where's the plot? I got you. Give me one second. Banana again. So we're having a normal conversation right now. That Nothing was the plot. Between the so that's the plot of the show. Teddy slapping him in his face. Okay. This conversation. Okay. Not factual. This is some real ishness. Okay, but on some real ishness, this show is literally about a big competition. Kind of like the Olympics, but I'll let the announcer go ahead and take care of this. Hello, my name is the Boochie Cat Bandit, and I'll be here to explain the Giat Olympics. But I'm Boochie Cat Attack. Hey, dude, I heard you're competing. Just know we're going to win that thing, baby. <laughs> Who the fudge are the writers of this show? Anyways, back to me. This shit is insane, dude. The Olympics is the bungee jump. We're about to really win this thing. Let me get some. I'll give you some if we win this game. Jesus. Anyways, back to me. Now the next event in the Giat Olympics is the water slide. 
slide, 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 slide. Shut up. Ah, Moochie can attack. Now, yes, today's event is the most dangerous slide race of all time. I mean, there was more loops in those slides than a cereal box with the fruit. And look how high they are. And just to let you know, this is a team event. Meaning they have to stick together. Literally. We're all doing this together. Why is he grabbing the cheeks? Someone help me. Ready? Go. Okay. Uh, it probably is. Bro, R.I.P. Bro, hands and mouth, feet and mouth. That's a show for a real. That's a real gooner show. Let's just be honest. That's a real gooner show, dude. So yeah, they won that event, but then the plot thickens. Banana peel. The shawty that was on this team decided to run away and go to another team on that KD type B. Now what's next is the water event. Bucci got it. Yup, the water event where you think they're doing that Michael Phelps type beat against Big Bro, but instead the rules are you have to keep this little ball in between you and your teammate and get to the end first. Who approved these games? Oh, dude. Let's look at some of the techniques. At number one, you got in between the net. At number two, we got in between the lips. Now we got in the yes. and next we have... What the fuck? Next event. Now we have the next is that an anime game? I don't know what the fuck that is, dude. It's crazy. Water event. It's Zucci crazy. Game, which is collecting these chocolate covered bananas and swimming with them all in your mouth. Ninja, what? I'm usually used to this site, but I, I can't do it today. Uh, don't worry. Let me show you how the pro does it. <laughs> go, 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 go. And now the last stage is another slide just on a banana boat. In doodle water. No way it gets strange, right? Silky covered Hennessy Typhoon. 